I just make sure when I'm in interviews or whatever the case may be, I could just scoop up, like, you know what I'm saying, the alleged card. You know what I'm saying? This happened allegedly. I slapped somebody up last week, allegedly. Feel me? I robbed the dude who stay on Pinecone Street, allegedly. If the feds ain't gonna catch on to me, like, I don't really care. Um, to be honest, I didn't even write the song. It was really off the dome. I was with my producer at the time, and I didn't even rap. You know what I'm saying? I was in the streets, robbing, killing, allegedly. He was like, bruh, like, feel me? Just, just talk about something that people could relate to for real, like, on the real. You know what I'm saying? I, I started thinking to myself, I'm like, well, what can I say to really, like, make these boys feel what I'm saying? So, you know what I'm saying? I just started talking about, like, feel me, what the business was. Uh, uh. Uh, I swear these is sweet. I swear to God, I grab my Glock before I brush my teeth. The block too hot, man. The cops, I leave them boys to cease. Yeah, a lot of people were saying, like, I don't brush my teeth just because I said that. Obviously, I brush my teeth. It's like, it's certain things that you do that you so used to doing, like, in a routine. It's just automatic. You know, you can't lack out here. It's no lack season. For me, I grab my... Mouse tool, you feel me? Cause at the end of the day, you know, you never you never know what's gonna happen. You feel me? You could be you could be on the toilet. The ops could be lurking right there. I'll tell y'all how I popped my favorite op May 17th. I right, so Pete, them boys was dissing on me. Jumped up on the live, I ain't surprised. Them bitches, homie. Couldn't believe my eyes. I'm way too hyped cause I got switches on me. But that's when I knew this generation was really messed up. You know what I'm saying? Like a lot of these boys really going on live, talking people and stuff like that. And they doing all this illegal stuff on live. It's like, bruh, how could you, how could you like possibly make the police's job easier? You know what I'm saying? Like I really hate people that just make the cops jobs easier and then complain about when they get caught. Like that really don't even make no sense for real. Like, I don't get it. So I went on my side. His name ain't Tonio. They call him Tony. Right outside of 79th and Partway. It's right next to Stony. I ain't even got no gloves on. I'm trying to get my thug on. I walk him down. This ain't no pound for pound. I'm trying to bust some. Ain't nobody fighting these days, bro. This ain't fighting no more. You know what I'm saying? All these old heads really think like, you feel me? People just running fades. If y'all run a fade, it's at least two, three blicks. You feel me? In that premises, bro. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, people ain't fighting no more, bro. Pride is like, you feel me? Pride is a real thing. I feel you. You know what I'm saying? Like, I would be hot too. So it's killer be killed out you. Allegedly. Extendo clip right on the blick, you know that shit was dumb on my Glock go buh, 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 just like a Jersey Club song. Yeah, bruh, I don't know, bruh, like, I, a lot of people who heard that song, like, they really just went crazy when they heard that one line, you know what I'm saying? Like, I could really say, that was, like, probably the catchiest little bar, you know what I'm saying, part of the song, you know that, buh, 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 buh. Shout out to Jersey and shout out to Philly, too, you know what I'm saying? I don't know who did it first. Jersey just rhymed, you know what I'm saying? Like, I mean, that's the first thing that came to mind. Shout out and took off quick right on my scooter. First thing I did was hit up JJ. Yeah, that's my producer. Told me not to worry. Took my blick and took my 30. It was no debate. He told me about the Jakes. I'll take the charge. You good, nigga. Shout out to my producer, man. JJ, salute, my brother. He already know what the business is. You feel me? We can't talk too much about it on the, on the, on the interview or whatever. But he really holding it down from over there. He probably mad that I released a song or whatever. But it's like, bro, it already happened. You know what I'm saying? He don't... He don't understand, bro. Like, feel me? It don't matter about no indictment. It don't matter about no arrest. You know what I'm saying? As long as it goes viral and as long as we get paid, man, we up. We gonna be eating oodles and noodles in that can, fam. Like, it's great. That's my nigga. I won't even cap. Only thing I really say is that he better never lack. If that nigga slip, the police gonna find that blick because he don't stay too far away. He live on 22nd Ave. I mean, you just gotta move tack out here. You know what I'm saying? Like, one false move, now you in a can. Now you, now you, now you in a can. You in a cell with another man. You feel me? You gotta get naked. You gotta get butt booty naked in front of him. You gotta shower in front of him. This, this a life I don't advise anybody to live. You know what I'm saying? But if you living like that, just move tack. Do what you gotta do, my boy. This all entertainment though. I ain't, I, I'm not advising nobody to do that. I ain't gonna lie. But yeah, man, we really out here. You feel me? Allegedly. You know what I'm saying? We really in the streets. Allegedly, bro. Like, you feel me? Like, if them boys hear this song, you know what I'm saying? And they wanna get up with me, you know what I'm saying? Like, they might as well bruh because huh, i mean the song allegedly 
allegedly, you feel me, speaks for itself. All right, y'all, it's that boy, Gio. I hope y'all boys enjoyed the video, man. If you made it this far into the video, please, please, please smash that like button. Hit the subscribe button, you know what I'm saying? If y'all boys want part two to the self-snitching anthem, if y'all want a lyric breakdown for part two from Tony, make sure y'all hit that like button, man. Hit that like button. I asked for 300 likes for the part two, so if you haven't listened to the part two yet, go ahead and do that, you know what I'm saying? This is part one. I can keep pushing out these type of, you know what I'm saying, style videos for y'all. Y'all let me know in the comments down, you know what I'm saying, what y'all want to see. Y'all want to see more music. Y'all want to see more skits. Y'all want to see both. Y'all want to see more videos like this, bro. Just let me know in the comments, man. I really do appreciate all the support. On another note, this is all entertainment. I don't do none of that. I am a YouTuber. I don't tote guns. I don't, pro like, I don't promote none of that, bro. Like, you feel me? Like, I'm not no gangster. None of that, bro. It's strictly for entertainment for y'all. But like I said, make sure y'all hit that like button and subscribe, man. And without further ado, I'm out. Right outside of 70 nothing partway, it's right next to Stony. I ain't even got no gloves on, I'm trying to get my thug on. I walk him down, this ain't no pound for pound, I'm trying to bust on. External clip right on the... <laughs>